Hey, it's Mr. Grable, and I'm showing you code spaces today. And I'm just going to show you kind of like the launch page and kind of what goes on in here. So the nice thing about code spaces is it's a free app too. So you can download it on your device. You can download it on a tablet, phones, um, Apple, Android. Um, if you have VR goggles, it works with VR goggles also, which is always a cool thing to explore. So that's right. We are going to be doing a lesson where you can make augmented reality. That's like putting a computer animation or putting like technology, um, like that digital technology in the physical environment. Or And um, you can also use VR. Um, so these aren't like must-haves, but definitely something fun. Some of you may have a merge cube. Um, you can design things using code spaces to go on a merge cube. We're not going to do that, but it is a possibility. So um, usually you come here and you're just going to log in and I'm just going to log in as my wife's account. I have her set up as a student in one of my classrooms. So we're going to sign in with Google and I'm going to pick her account. She's very nice of me to do this. All right, one second. Let me see what my, my daughter needs me to open up some paint for her. All right, there you go. Bye, William. So now once we're here, this is the class that she's in. She's in Mrs. Geetson's class. Usually kids like to check out the gallery. So the gallery is a whole bunch of things already made from people around co spaces. So we have some different categories, STEM and coding. We got social, um, social sciences. We got language arts and literature. We got maker space and art. Now there's a whole bunch of really cool um, different things that you can check out. Now this fifth grade passion project, oh my gosh, this is like one of the coolest things I've, I've seen as a teacher. They, um, it's a whole bunch of interactive digital presentations that a class worked on. If you want, you can like check out this 3D shrine. So somebody actually made this and you'll see these icons here. This right here is for a merge cube. So um, I don't have a merge cube right now with me. I do have some in the library, um, but you can go ahead and play these. And um, somebody made this really cool scene and you can click and drag. You can also use the arrow keys to kind of move through um, this presentation. Now, some things are interactive. Um, so I wonder if I click this. No, sometimes it wouldn't uh, like let it like ring the bell. So there's a whole bunch of different um, ones that you can do. Um, let me show you one that like this parkour game. So somebody made this. You can open it up and it's locked. Um, and you can use spacebar to jump. So I'm going to try. I was playing this earlier. I didn't get very far. Um, see if it takes me. Whoops. Oh, see how it, like, I fall into the lake and I lose a life. So let's see here. Not super easy. Um, some of you that, like, do, that play Minecraft and Roblox and things may find it easier to navigate than, than I do. All right, let's see. Oops, I want to be on that, so... All right, so you you get it. So that's the gallery. It's really pretty pretty cool to check out some of these things. You can click view all, and then you can find more of them. This colorful Jenga is really fun. This is a cool one if you want to do um, augmented reality on the on your phone, and you when you click them, it pulls it out, and then you can navigate around. So like, um, definitely a fun. A fun way to use augmented and virtual reality with this colorful Django type of game. Now, we are probably not going, you are probably not going to be able to make something quite as amazing as this because we are using the free account. So a lot of this was made with the premium account. So what you can do is you can go over to this class and then you can join your class and you'll have an assignment. This was a maze that I was working on. That's the assignment later. You can also check out this free play. This free play, I'm going to make another video, but this is really going to be important for you to learn how to navigate co-spaces and how to design and how to do things in here. And I'll have another video going through that. 
So this is kind of co-spaces, the gallery, and then the free play. I think that you'll enjoy it.